Google just dropped this awesome AI tool called Career Dreamer. It actually uses real job data to dig into your entire background. I'm talking everything from those super technical roles to your client facing gigs. And then it uncovers all your amazing transferable skills. Yes, transferable skills. That is the huge key here. It is super hard for us to figure out those out on our own, especially connecting all the dots across our own various experiences and then comparing them to thousands of job descriptions to find a good match. So in the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how to build a super powerful career story from scratch and discover jobs you're absolutely qualified for based on your own transferable skills. Ready to see this in action? actually ready to do this in action, grab your laptop, phone or tablet and follow along with me. Just head over to grow.google slash career dreamer. All right, once you type the URL, you're going to end up over here, which is the landing page for career dreamer. Then you're going to click on the get started now, which will take you to this particular app, which is the actual career dreamer app. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my own career as an example. And as you can see, I have changed different roles. I started as a programmer and then I moved into pre-sales. Um, so we'll use this as an example to see if it is able to actually suggest where I am today based on the skills which were transferable earlier. Let's do that. So let's start with by clicking the start button and it's going to start with asking what to share any of the current or previous roles. So I'm going to share my one of my previous roles, which is a sales engineer, which is like a pre-sales consultant. And I'm going to write analytics machine learning and AI. So what it's going to do is it's going to ask uh, to confirm the kind of tasks you performed as a sales engineer, right? So it's very important that we do this because this is where it is going to identify the skills. I delivered compelling technical presentations. I definitely collaborated with the sales teams and then I crafted customized technical proposals. I needed to have a strong understanding of competitive and at POCs and then definitely strong relationships with the key and clients right stakeholders at the clients. So that is what I did. And then from those tasks, it is able to find the kind of key skills, right? So technical sales, solution selling, definitely strong presentation skills, problem solving, data analysis. These were some of the important skills that I actually had, right? So based on that, you can see now it is starting to put together a career identity statement. This is very important, right? So you can see I empower businesses to harness a transformative power of AI and machine learning. As a sales engineer, I excel at bridging the gap between complex technical concepts and business value. Right? So it's starting to get there. Now, I can add some more experiences over here or I can start adding more education. So let's start with education. And I'm an MBA in marketing, so I'm just going to do that as an ad so that it starts taking that flavor of marketing into my career identity as well. So based on that, it's going to ask me, okay, what are the skills that apply to you? Marketing strategy, digital marketing. I did communication and financial analysis as well as part of the, as part of my MBA. So now it's redefining my career identity statement, right? Now here's the key skill. So you, you can see that you can add more experiences. You can add more education. So for example, I can add my bachelor's, which is my engineering, uh, engineering in IT and then it will add more insights based on this particular educational degree as well right so i definitely learned about database management system analysis problem solving etc so the key here is as you start adding more of your experiences educations and you also have the capability to add your own skills it is going to go figure out and connect the dots between all of these right and it's going to keep refining your identity statement but the most important aspect here in my opinion is the interest because this is what drives you to land into a job which is really your dream job right so i'm definitely very interested in artificial intelligence I'm interested in marketing and then I'm interested in data, right? So these are some of the three three different top things that I really enjoy and I'm mostly in customer facing kind of roles. So based on that, these are some of the skills or statements that apply to me, right? So I want to leverage data driven insights to create meaningful insights. I like building systems. I enjoy creating narratives. So based on this, I think the first two are more appropriate for me. Now it has added where I want to go, right? So now you will see that the career identity statement has changed as well 
well. And if you're not satisfied with this, you can always regenerate the career identity statement, right? Or if you want to go back, then there is this little history button as well. So you can go back and select anyone which was previously generated for you. Okay, so experiences, you can keep adding education, skills and interest, right? And you always have the capability to keep adding. Now, once you're really satisfied with this, then you will click on the explore paths. And this is where the magic starts to happen, right? It's now all connecting your data, your interests, your education, your experiences with all of the job data that it has access to. And it is now able to give you different paths right so you can see if i click on this these paths are based on my experiences education skills and interests and you can see that it is suggesting me very interesting paths right so i could be i could think of being a data engineer i could think of being an analytics manager when it also gives me like a typical experience and th th there are a lot of interesting other paths which it is suggesting data scientist because of the experience there then it's also suggesting an account executive role which is very interesting because if you see really after being a sales engineer my next role really was in a big way was an account executive so it's suggesting the path which i took which is exactly what i wanted to see if it is able to figure out transferable skills right so let's say that i select the analytics manager skill as to try and understand what this really is so it tells me like the average salary this is coming from the information here um, and then what kind of typical degree it, it needs the key thing here is it actually explains you why it thinks this is the sweet spot for me, right? So it explains that your MBA in marketing combined with your experience in technical sales provides a unique blend of business acumen and technical understanding, which can help me land this particular role. It's ensuring that you understand and you believe that your skills are actually transferable so that when you are giving that interview out there, you are able to be confident answer there. So that is a sweet spot. Then this is, this is an amazing one where it also tries to explain you and give you a day in the life of the role that you might be looking at. So this allows you to really ensure that you see yourself in this and you're satisfied with what you will be doing on, on a day-to-day -day basis. So that's that. And then the next one is what are the areas for growth? So again, from a job interview perspective, this could be very interesting because now you already see what are transferable and then there are some areas which you may not be having the right experience because you didn't do this role before and you can already start working towards it. And one way to do this is to get into some sort of a certification. So now, you know, when, whenever you know, you're giving the interview, you can say that, hey, in order to fill the gap, I actually went through the certification process. Here it is suggesting you multiple different certifications, which can actually help you bridge that gap, right? So data analytics so for being an analytics manager, Google data analytics certificate is really a perfect one, right? So this is like a really cool way for you to see why you're a good fit. And then once you're satisfied with this, then you actually go into Gemini and this is where you can go workshop the resume, workshop the cover letter, and then or possibly also explore more job ideas, right? And at any point in time, you can go back and revisit your different paths so let's say i want to now look at the account executive path and then it's going to take you through the whole process again it's going to explain you why you have a sweet spot what would be the day in the life for an account executive and then also areas for growth right so it's fantastic what it can do one other cool thing is let's say that i do not want to take my education into consideration and then based if i deselect that based on that it would come up with potentially some different career paths that you can explore right so that that is where now it is suggesting me technical evangelist and if you see it is also suggesting some very new type of roles for example like ai solution architect so these are roles which did not exist long back so there is not enough data but then it is still able to select and suggest that based on its own understanding of gemini right so you can directly jump to gemini you can copy this to the clipboard and then continue to do this analysis from gemini so overall this is the entire tool you get your career identity then explore the different paths and then once you're clear and satisfied with a specific path then you can go and do some more interesting work with gemini all right, so we just took a real world path from a hands-on programmer to a strategic pre-sales consultant and turned it into a very powerful story and mapped to an incredible new career, all in just a few minutes. Now it's your turn.
Your challenge is to head to grow.google slash career dreamer and build your own story. Uncover those hidden skills, discover your next path and take that step with total confidence. If this video sparked an idea, please do me a huge favor and hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss out on more tools to help you build your future. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.